Afternoon guys, let's today talk about what things we should consider before move or pick the main equipment from a warehouse. For example, is, is, this is a very uh, equipment is the always equipment is the always expensive. So before we move material from warehouse to the site for any company for solar company or auto different engineering companies is working in our uh, world. So what things we should consider before move or pick material equipment from warehouse. This is the very important. Otherwise, you can lose the material. Material can be damaged if you put on the side for 10 days, 4 days, 1 week. It can be damaged, your material. It, you can be vandalized. Material can be vandalized. So, be careful whenever you move or ship or pick material from the warehouse. You have to consider few things before mobilize the material to the uh, field. Number one, check the property of the site. Is there any access issue? Uh, is there any, any problem from the landlord or any property dispute? Make sure you have to pick, before you have to pick material, make sure you have to check. There is no property issue. There is no legal issue, dispute, nothing. You can put the material on site and you can carry on the work. So this is the very important to check the property point of view if there is any problem neighbor pala pala municipal council there are a lot of the problems when you put the actual material on site and uh, so before you pick the material think about it second beside the main material you need also different supplier material before move the main material from warehouse to the site, you have to check the supplier material, small, small material from other supplier. Either these are the ready or the delay. If the delay, please keep the main material in warehouse until it will be ready, until supplier material will be ready. Otherwise, you put the main material on site, expensive material on site equipment, and you will wait for supplier material. At the end, material can be lost. Main material have the problems, trouble. So, you have to check also. And second thing is that uh, many companies nowadays start the trend. When you have to pick the material, you have to install within 5 to 7 days. From, For example, any company subcontractor pick the material from the warehouse, company warehouse. And he go to the site due to the different issue he could not install. So, there is the timeline from the company to subcontractor you have to finish it in within four to five days so if you can't finish the installation within four to five days or uh, defined timeline don't pick the material you have to prepare yourself your teams your uh, car your vehicle everything your equipment tool check before pick the material especially i'm requesting to subcontractor otherwise you can a uh, subcontractor will be a trouble. Main company will be penalize you. Why is not in store? Because they are worried. They have the millions of the material, millions of dollar of the material. The price is high. If you guys keep uh, give us excuses, it's not acceptable. So please make sure you are the ready to install the site before you pick up the material from site number three. And Fourth is very important things. That is the once you receive the material documents, what you have to pick from the uh, from the warehouse, you have to check. This is the enough material. This is the enough material to install complete the site. If you see this is this this is the missing some part are missing or some material is mismatch what we need not they giving us the wrong material you have to double check there is we we are also uh, human we can mistake but subcontractor have to double check either this material have enough or is there any shortage or it's any is there any wrong material we supply so don't pick you have to reply the, on the email on material documents then 
the concerned person have to check and you have you have to pick the right dog, the right equipment from warehouse and it should be enough check the design check the tss uh, check the tssr technical site survey reports before you pick the material carefully okay and uh, fifth things i will tell you that is also important it can be affect your work maybe you need some permission to start the work maybe you need some approval letter authority letters so check do you have before pick the material okay there are the many side in the field they have the different supplier subcontractor need to work before you have to carry on for example i am giving to you if you have you have you are the solar company and solar you are shipping the solar plates and inverter pala pala on site but there is civil work is not finished the bracket or whatever beams or block are not in stock so how you have to install that the solar plates or some work is out of stock so before pick the before move the material for our example solar plates and uh, inverter or other cables check either civil work is done or not bracket or everything installed or not so this is the important so before you mobilize the material make sure is the civil work should be finished and third thing i will tell you sorry sixth thing i will tell you that when your material is on site don't open material from boxes check the site is is there any power upgrade required or council power or municipal power or wabda phalana phala check check the power is okay power is a important thing if you put and install the material and you you can't run the site or you can't run the site what what is what is the logic to install the material equipment so please check before you pick the material check on site everything is fine power especially power power or anything uh, is okay you have to check with meter in the db is the power is live or not maybe landlord didn't pay the meter maybe the council cut the cable when you when you arrive on site with equipment equipment is very expensive don't open from boxes we can return in the warehouse but once you open the from boxes it's problem to return so before you open the material check on site the power is live is working everything is sufficient what power side needed it is sufficient or not otherwise don't pick it don't open from boxes we have to return in the warehouse material is very expensive we can't just install and purpose not achieve if the electricity is not on site why we need to install it okay and and seven things seven thing i am telling to you there is the always many side require the some customized material some special bracket or in special tools so also check it's okay or not size of bracket for example you pick the bracket uh, from the uh, you pick the material bracket from the supplier or warehouse and when you are on site it not work side is small or big it's not work maybe some problem so check these things are okay or not before open material from boxes and uh sometimes is a telecom things uh their network is live side is run so you have to check do you have the approval to cut cut over approval or something there are many terminologies used you have to get approval from client before you uh, off the site to do your installation or additional work upgrade the site so these are the nine or some few important things you have to consider before pick the material for the site thank you very much uh, for watching this video vlog please don't forget to subscribe my channel thank you